Hey, what's up guys? Hope you all have an amazing day. It's your boy Jay, the Motor Marauder, back out again with another video. And in today's video, we are talking about different bag options that different storage options different storage options that you guys may be considering uh, when running a motorcycle. As you guys know, these these machines aren't cars which have extra storage in the back. You have the back seats, front seats, trunk, or the frunk if you're if you're like that. Um, yeah, you might be thinking of like different storage options and on sports bikes you have different options than cruisers. Cruisers have different options than ADVs. But I'm going but I'm gonna be going over a couple of options that I'm gonna be going over a couple of options that most most riders might be able to consider. Uh, there are some that I'm not going over because since I haven't used them, I'm just been going over the, the three options that I've used and I've experienced and how they fit for me. So option number one is if you're a cruiser or a uh, a sport touring or a touring bike, you might be considering saddlebags. As you guys know, I usually have been using the the Milwaukee bags on the back of my Marauder, but I had a hole in them, so I took them out. But saddlebags are one of the best options if you're having a cruise. If you're if you aren't riding a sport bike, I think there are some that you use on sport bikes, but I'm not really sure. But overall, that's. Out of all the options that I'm going to be going over, those are the most storage, and they just hold they just hold a lot of things. Sometimes they do get bulky. Roads are wet. Gotta be careful. Saddlebags hold the most, but they are a bit bulky. If you guys got a cruiser, I would definitely recommend them. They come in very handy. Alongside that, for cruisers, another option would be a handlebar bag, a fork bag, just. A bag that goes on the front, like sort of in this area, it doesn't hold much. You can hold like you can store your wallet, your phone, your keys, some extra like first aid stuff and all that. Just hold stuff like that in there. And those two are like the main ones for cruisers, I'd guess. I'd say. But. I think other I think many other bikes can have them. Um, for sport bikes, I think the equivalent is like a tail bag. It's like a little box or a little bag on the tail of your bike. That's pretty much the equivalent of the saddle bag for a sport bike. And those come in handy too. I haven't used it myself, but for but you can also get a tank bag. Tank bag for the front. It holds stuff too. It's similar to a tail bag in size. It should be very handy. Alright, the next option is a waste bag. You know, a fanny pack, a waste bag, a side bag, those type of things. You can get them from any uh, store. I think Lulu Lemon holds them, Adidas, Nike. You can get many different off brand versions on Amazon. I've been using an off brand one from Amazon for like a year now. Usually, there I just hold my cards, business cards, stuff like that. small stuff like that don't really carry much around in them and that's pretty much universal for anyone who's riding and a similar thing would be a thigh bag I don't know how many guys use those if you guys do comment down below because I've been thinking of getting one but I don't know like if it's versatile or useful or not because I'm riding a cruiser and the last option I would say would be a backpack Backpacks are universal, they come pretty cheap, come pretty expensive. If you want one for motorcycle riders with extra as a supporter, extra as a, extra as a support on them, they may cost you a, a, a hefty penny. But if you just want a generic backpack, you can get them pretty cheap 20, 30 bucks. And you should be good to go with that. As I think those come next to next in storage from saddlebags on a bike. And I've been using my uh, Amazon Amazon tactical style backpack for a while now, and honestly, I've enjoyed using that more than the saddlebags because it's on my body. I can bring it with me into like shops and do uh, fast food restaurants and all that, like Burger King and W McDonald's. Uh, most places say you can't wear a backpack. I just leave it up at the front, 
and then when I purchase some stuff, I just put stuff in there, and it's pretty good, man. And those are my options for storages. Those are my, those are the options I'd say you should try out for storage if you're just starting out on riding a bike and you need storage, because everyone needs storage, man. Everyone needs storage. And with that, guys, I'm gonna end today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll catch you on the next one. See ya. Stay safe, ride safe. If, if you are out riding in this cold weather, stay warm, stay safe. And I'll catch you on the next one. See ya.